It's hard. It's really fun to judge because you get to see all the best science journalism that's out there. It's very difficult. It's amazing to see how, how much good workmanship there is out there. It's a very serious process and it's an impressive process. Um, each of the judges brings a different, a different kind of expertise and so there's a lot of discussion. The challenges of judging are that we don't agree, um, at least not initially, and people make the case for uh, individual articles or videos and um, we go back and sometimes review, reread um, and take another look uh, before coming to a final determination. What you want to do is engage the reader right at the get-go and then take them through the whole narrative explaining the science along the way but making it painless. Those are the winning entries. Does it really report good science? That is, do you get insight into the scientific process um, and what research is all about? I really enjoy reading all the stories, of course. I love the discussion with the other judges. I'm amazed at how many good, thoughtful journalists there are out there who really care about the journalism, who really care about the science, and the level of knowledge that some people have. Just need to remember that science journalism is like any other type of journalism. It's storytelling. You need to tell a story. You need a beginning, a middle, and end. The beginning is critical. You have to get your reader engaged in your subject. It's, it's amazing how um, many pieces are strong but lack a strong beginning. So that's something everyone needs to constantly hone. Finding that right balance between not oversimplifying but not getting lost in the jargon of science.